so if you want to open the registry then click on start menu and search for reg edit or you can go to c drive c drive windows and here if you scroll down you will see reg edit file so double click reg edit and it should open up the registry editor console now here before you make any changes uh, in the registry it's always good to take a backup of registry so to take backup go to file and click on export then select the location where you want to backup registry and give name to the backup file file extension would be .reg and then click save so if i go to that location then a registration entries type of file will be created which will be the backed up registry now if uh, i want to restore this registry then simply double click it and it will ask you if you want to continue to restore this particular .reg file click yes and then it will say all the keys and values from that file have been successfully added so this way you can back up the you can restore the backed up registry file now here in registry you can create new keys or you can create new values so here if i right click and click on new key then a new key is created below below outlook if i want to create a new key below 16.0 then i will right click 16.0 and say new key so this way you can create a new key or you can also create a new value so these are all uh, different values and these are all keys so if i want to create a new value go to new and let's say i want to create a d word value then click on d word and then you can type the name so this way you can create new uh, registry values now if i want to add data to this value double click it and you can set whatever data you want to set to delete any key or any value just right click and click on delete if i want to rename some value or rename some key then just right click and click on rename so that will allow me to rename any key or value if i want to search for any key in entire registry then click here on computer and press control plus f and then search for whatever keys and values or data that you want to search so you can also manage permissions for registry so go to edit and go to permissions and here you can see who has read access to registry and who has full control
so if you want you can remove permissions or you can add permissions for new users